Okay, so now here we are. We are going to talk about some of the cool technical features of the truck and look at the interior, what's done um, so far, and also show you some of the functions and just some of the really cool details. So starting off, what we have here is we have our original fuel filler location. Um, our tank's behind the bed. I'll show you that here in a minute. But opening this, what you see is you have a fingerprint ID scanner. So you take and open the door with your fingerprint. Super cool. And what we've done is we have added the uh, Trick Manufacturing Altman Easy Latch setup. So it's a modern style door latch. Uh, moving on, we have our Billet Specialties door interior door handles. We have uh, set it up with a new Relic uh, uh, power windows. And I've created the switch, or we got the switch style so you can use a typical handle. So there's down. There's up with your windows, works amazingly well. Moving on into the cab, we have a 58 Impala style steering wheel that is a, a, a shrunken down version. These are typically, I think, 18 inches. We have, uh, there's a company that's making uh, reproduction in the 15 inch size, so you've got a nice uh, uh, smaller diameter wheel see behind it what we have here is we have the TCI billet uh, paddle shifter setup that ties into the TCI 6x transmission this allows you to manually choose your gears um, moving on it's sitting on top of a chrome I did it uh, tilt style steering column and over here we have a classic instrument we have our classic instrument stuff we have our our classic instruments clock and then we have our classic instruments uh digital style well it's not digital sorry it's a electronic gauge set um moving on we we have installed uh power wipers electric power wipers up here you also have your traditional um 12 volt old school cigarette lighter still works like it should uh we have a custom auto sound uh, 740 USA style head unit in here. It's a uh, Bluetooth enabled. It's got a microphone. It's got all of its RCA um, pre outs and you know pretty cool little setup. Looks looks fairly period correct. Moving on from that, we have our Vintage Air setup in here, and this is just an awesome system. It's a uh, uh, electronic controls it's actually a mixing system so it does function like a modern car you can have your heat and your conditioner run at the same time so you're blowing hot dry air here's our low car uh, nostalgia 4l80 e style floor shifter um, we've gone with this this uh, shifter stick style because um, it's proper for the truck you've got all of your all of your movement doesn't interfere with the seat at all and moving on from that we are going to talk about the rear view camera um you saw the camera lens outside mounted into the license plate so here is a um rvs um frameless mirror and what i've done is i've taken and painted the back side of it the uh same bombay ivory that we have everywhere else. Uh, you turn the key on, reverse, you can look as you're backing up. And with that being said, this thing has great visibility compared to a modern car, period. Just, it's all windows, all the way around. You know, you've got a two inch B pillar, two inch A pillar. It's just all glass in here. It's what you would call a fishbowl of fishbowls. Okay, so moving on from that, what else we have is we have a Bedwood flip kit to access your fuel filler. So there's a switch mounted back here and you can open and you can see your fuel filler back there and close it. This is also controlled with a remote control. Um, so you can use the same key fob because you also have a keyless entry system too. 
So the same key fob can work for uh, opening your bed wood, opening your doors, and all of that good stuff. So, uh, oh, one thing I did forget to show about the inside are some of the kind of hidden switches. What we've done here is we've got, there's, there's your control switches for your TCI 6X transmission. You've got a performance mode, you've got a torque converter lockup button, and you have the manual mode buttons. Trying to keep those out of the, um, uh, just kind of, you know, trying to keep the interior as clean as we can. Here is your switch for your electronic cutouts. And moving up here is your switch for your electronic parking brake. This does have an e-stop electronic parking brake on it. Um, super cool. And, and yeah, so that's kind of what we have going on with the interior and some of the super trick functionality of this truck. It's, uh, it's pretty cool. So.